What's up guys, it's Luke Mitchell here and today I'm doing, doing a top 5 for my first ever I'm going to start this new series called Top 5 and I'm going to do a top 5 best maps you should buy so for example you only have maybe, you only have $50 and you want to buy oh but I want to buy Zombies Chronicles and I want to buy Revelations what should I do? Well, that's gonna, that's why I'm gonna be helping you. And hopefully these are some good things you might wanna use. You might not agree with me, that's fine. This is my opinion in this top five. But without failing guys, let's go. We are number five, we have Varox from Black Ops 1 and World at War. And I think this is a pretty good uh, map. It's standing, four perks, you got me all kicking now. And it was also pretty some Huntables, which I like. And yeah, you just got um, no pack mods, which makes it just a little bit more harder. The power is easy to get to, and yeah, I think it's fun probably to play solo and with friends. And yeah, it's just that's it. That was correct, and that comes in at our number pack up. For number four, we have um, the Eisendrack from Black Ops Three, which I'm playing right now, and I really like this map. You know, it's fun to get the high rounds. You got the bows, you got the water spheres, you got the gravity spike, and you got the Easter egg. Be wise to feel um, my power. And yeah, that's really it. So, and you got the zombie shield as well. And I think that's also cool. Um, you can get, you have four different ones. You have fire, the fire bow, the lightning bow, void bow, and the wolf bow. And yeah, and that's really it for it. And it comes in at number four. Coming in at our number three spot, we have the Reef or the Giant from um yeah yeah from wait yeah wait yeah from so with the Reef that is from the one and with uh already um. Yeah, the giant from Black Ops 3, sorry. Uh, I just Your didn't schedule the top 5 before I made it. Uh, I was quite unorganized, but with this, you got your basics. Um, It's just nice. Not really. You just got Milk Kick, your four perks, Pack a Punch, and the Catwalk, and that's really all you got. And you just. Those two come in at number 3. And coming in at our number 2 spot on our list. Surprise, surprise, we have Trendle Off and Black Ops 1. Why do you think this one? Well, first of all, I actually love this one. Um, you got the Baby Maker, you got the Raygun, you got Pack a Bunch, you got the Perp, you got, um, the Side Easter Egg. I think it's a pretty cool map. And you got all your basics, really. And yeah, that's it. Alright, coming in at our number one spot. Guys, will there be anything else? But, Mop of the Dead from Black Ops 2. Where do we even start? I love this map. You got the Blob Gap, you got the Plane, you got four new characters. What else you got? Um, oh yeah, you got the Death Machine. You got Regal Mark 2, Regal Mark 1. You got whatever. If I release you, will the favor That's it. Be returned? That's all I'm going to do for that. Really? Just. That's it for that map. And, yeah, that's it.